Hey you guys, all right, so today I have something very exciting to share with you and show you. I'm gonna demo everything. A new way of doing my foundation, not just with a new product, but in just a totally different way that simplified everything. The same product for my foundation, for my concealer, for my contour, you can use it for bronzer, you can use it to highlight. One product that does it all, each shade has a built-in brush so you don't have to have a million different applicators and brushes. It's such a multi-purpose foundation stick, which is so cool. It is the Lancome Tint Idol Ultra Wear Foundation Stick. So before we get into the tutorial, because I'm gonna get so in depth on how to apply it, and I think you're gonna find it like really fun and different like it's just fun to use so this is sponsored by Lancome I've really enjoyed working with them finding some new great things and this you guys is unlike anything that you've ever tried it's so unique and I'm gonna tell you why I want to talk a little bit about the product itself the finish the wear super long wearing okay so it's up to 24 hours of comfortable wear it has this really unique natural matte finish so it transforms from a cream to a powder like almost instantly as you're using it and it doesn't feel like anything's on your skin which I really love. So lightweight, so silky, oil-free. My skin has been loving it. So I love that. I love that it sets easily on its own. You don't have to add anything else to it. It's comfortable. It does a really good job of minimizing imperfections and pores. You'll see just how well it covers. It's very impressive and it really does keep your skin shine free, which I appreciate. Truly nothing I've ever used has even come close to this. Nothing like it. And in the way that I apply it, you guys are going to see it's very different from anything else. Y'all are going to flip. This is just so good and I cannot wait to, um, can't wait to share. So this is what I've been wearing in my recent posts and things like that and um, in my recent videos. And I just really do think that you guys are going to fall in love with it like I have. All right, so this could not be simpler. You just start with the shade of the foundation stick that matches your skin tone. For me, that is 210 Buff Neutral. Now, a little of this goes such a long way. It has so much pigmentation and it just covers beautifully. So then I take the little kabuki brush on the end and blend it right in. You can use your fingertips. You can use a brush, anything you want. This one is actually really nice for blending, I feel. I think that it's precise enough where you can get it right under your eyes if you wanna use a little, you know, for concealing some darkness under your eyes. And that's what I love about this is that I don't need a million different products. I don't need, um, you know, other eye concealers or face concealers. It's just kind of everything all in one. If you need to go back and cover any extra redness or anything, I just love that it's so easy. So anywhere where you have some discoloration, you know, you can go back, you can add a little here and a little there, just as you would your concealer. It's pretty impressive. I just, I love that. And I love that you can just take it like I did a little before, put it right up under your eyes for your under eye concealer. I'm gonna show you a little trick with a lighter color that I use in a second that I use for highlight. Now, I don't like to use that as my under eye concealer, but I do have a really good brightening trick for up under your eyes that I think you'll really like. And despite being so full coverage, it feels so light, you know? And like I said, it's set, it's just, it's, it's so cool. So then I'm gonna add some dimension to my skin. Call it contouring, you could use this as a bronzer. I don't wanna contour to make my face look a different shape or to do anything like that. I think, especially for a product that's more full coverage like this, or really any foundation that I like to use that's gonna really perfect my skin, using a contour shade is so great because it just gives your skin some dimension. It just livens up your face. It gives your skin some light. And I like to use the shade 420 Bisque for that. And again, it's so nice because you don't have to fool with a bunch of different products, a bunch of different brushes, because the brush for this one is made in to this one. So what I like to do is start with just a light, um, not a huge swipe, I mean, not as, as much or as little as you like, um, around your forehead, just right at your hairline. And this brush is just so perfect for blending. It just gives you such a nice blend. Fix my little hairs after this. But you can see it just really blends right into that other shade. And I think that's what is so cool about using this type of product for everything because it's not like layering a powder over a cream, over a powder over a cream, or different products that aren't made to go together. It's the same product, you know what I mean? So it just blends flawlessly into, you know, the shade from before. I put whatever's left 
right there, and then a little bit on your cheekbones right here, just right along there, put the most right here in this hollow, and then just kind of fade it down. And um, again, you know, the brush just works really great for that. So you can kind of use your fingers to blend it as well. But I think this little brush, it's soft, but it's also very dense. It just blends so perfectly. I mean, it's obviously made to be used with this, but it really does such a good job. Just gave my skin some life, so I just really love that. I think that's such a cool trick. And then I also like to take just a little bit and go right down the center of my nose, or down the side of the center of my nose on each side, and just kind of let it like hook around right there. And then again, and again, the most perfect brush to blend this out. And you could certainly go a little darker or a little more, you know, with the contouring if that's what you were wanting to do. You could do a little around your jawline, but I just think that's the perfect amount. And if you want to take it a step further, I really like a lighter shade for highlighting. So I use the shade 90 Ivory Neutral. And like that trick that I used to do, you know, with the triangle under my eyes years ago, I kind of do the same thing, except, you know, just make it kind of look like a little heart. So it doesn't go down too far, it doesn't like hook around under your eyes, and, and then you look like you've chosen the wrong concealer color. It's just right in this area where you would want to brighten a little bit, and it's also not going to, you know, overlap too much the concealer that you put on before, because it just layers so nice. And you kind of want it to almost come to a point right there, right above the apple of your cheeks, and that just like lights up your whole face. Right, so totally brightening. You didn't have to use a bunch of like, you know, powders or layer a whole ton of stuff. And then usually the contour is enough down the side of my nose to where like just the natural color of your nose, um, you know, kind of makes its own little lightness, but just do the tiniest little bit. So a little dot right on the center of your nose and then a very thin line down the middle. All right, so your skin is done. You don't have to apply like blush and bronzer and all those things, it's just, it feels light. It doesn't feel like I'm wearing anything. It's so cool. I'll link to the products that I used for my mascara and for my eyeliner, my eyes and stuff. Also what I've been using on my lips lately, which is my absolute favorite, this natural mauve pencil. I want to get these in other colors. I used to really like the bronzel. So I've been meaning to pick that one up again. And then this lipstick has just been my absolute favorite. It's the Nude Essential in the drama mat. It's just such a nice everyday color that's just a little extra but doesn't feel fussy. That's what I really like about all this makeup is that I don't feel like I'm wearing heavy makeup. You know what's cool? It's kind of what I feel about this whole look is that you know my skin doesn't feel like there's anything on it. It just has like that natural matte like I said, like a second skin, like silky finish that just feels like I'm touching my skin. Like it doesn't feel like I'm touching makeup or anything. And the lipstick is the same. It's not goopy. It's on, but it just feels like comfortable and just like my lips. So that's it, you guys. I'll link to, like I said, all the rest of the makeup that I'm wearing. Again, big thanks to Lancome for partnering with me again. And y'all, just definitely check this out. This is so different and so cool. The Lancome Tint Idol Ultra Wear Foundation Stick. I think that you're just gonna love it. And it's so unique. It's definitely simplified my products. And it's just for sure a new favorite of mine. So thank you guys for watching and spending the time with me today. Love you so much. Have a great rest of your day and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.